How's it going guys, Arozo here and today we're going to be having story time. Okay guys, so um, some of you might be confused, but um, today we're going to be telling the story of what happened to me yesterday. Um, not just me, me and my girlfriend, and now that I look back on it, it's quite funny, but at the time it was it was quite serious. So um, I got invited to go to my girlfriend's mum's house for a week, and you have to get the train from where I live to get to her house, which is in a place called Preston. So um, we got to her mum's and it was all fine, having fun, and we spent a week there and it was all fun really good and I really enjoyed it so it ended up we basically got the train home but when we got the train we got the train to Preston train station so in Preston train station or any other train station they have like these boards of where the train goes and the time it comes so we had to look at the board and we have to get off at a place called Lancaster and the board said Lancaster blah 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 Penrith Glasgow and stuff like that and Penrith and Lancaster are quite far apart to be honest um, it's about an hour and a half of drive from where I live so we got on the train and we noticed we were coming up to the Lancaster train station and the train didn't stop it just went straight past Lancaster train station everyone on the train was confused and that's it my girlfriend was getting really upset and obviously we only had enough money to get to Lancaster from Preston and luckily uh, the train like ticket woman person I don't know what they're called like when we went past Lancaster she was like tickets please so um we explained we had no tickets and we only had enough money to get back from to Lancaster from Preston so um she let us off being as nice as she is and she basically said right so um we'll let you off at the next stop which was Penrith so you can get a train back to Lancaster but you have to pay the ticket, pay for the ticket from Penrith to Lancaster. So it was really confusing and we didn't even have enough money to get the train back from Penrith because it's so far from Lancaster and we only had enough money for Preston to Lancaster. So um, anyway, we got off the train at Penrith and we sat there and waited for a train. Um, luckily enough, one came for Lancaster and Knowing our luck, it was only it was the only train going to Lancaster that day, and it was a it was a first class train. And as you guys may know, first class trains are so expensive, like seriously expensive. It was like thirty pound just for me to get back to Lancaster on first class. So we just got on the train anyway. We didn't realise until we actually got off the train how much it would be. So um, we got on the train, we sat down, and. Basically, we didn't have enough money, so we had to pretend to be asleep on the train. Because, this is a tip for you guys. If you're asleep on a train, a um, the ticket person cannot wake you up. They, they can like at least say, ticket please, and stuff like that. But if you do not reply or wake up, they cannot shake you to wake you up or touch you or anything like that. So, they're just going to walk straight past. Luckily enough, the ticket man walked straight past me and my girlfriend. And... It was it, if it was quite scary because if we um, got caught getting a train for free, sort of, um, then we could get done for it. Like, it's quite a big matter. Um, I don't really know where I'm going with this, guys. I'm thinking of this off the top of my head. <laughs> um, so yeah, so we're on the train, and the ticket guy went past like five times within the space of going back to Lancaster from Penrith. So um, we got off the train and. Obviously, the ticket guy was staring at us, and obviously he was looking at us to see if there's any adults with us, to see if they paid for us as their ch children. I, I don't know. It was just staring at us. Some of my girlfriend just walked off and um, was ready to get the train from Lancaster to Morecambe. We had to get a lot of trains that day. <laughs> so um, we got the train, and my girlfriend's phone died. So she couldn't ring her mum. So her mum's worrying because she's not replied. Um, since she left her house, uh, which is in Preston, and we went all the way to Penrith, from Penrith to Lancaster, and from Lancaster to Morecambe. So we got on the train to Morecambe anyway from Lancaster, and um, 
we got off. And the train station is quite far from my girlfriend's house. And she basically had to, like, sort of run home. So she's able to message her mum. And I ran to my house or tried to find Wi-Fi. Uh, so I could message her mum, tell him that we're fine and stuff. So, yeah. Um, we eventually got into Morecambe. And, like... We both had a laugh about it, like, it was quite funny once we've, like, looked back and, like, I don't know, it was just it was just some, one of those where it's serious at the time, but you look back on it and, like, laugh about it. So, um, if you, it's a bit weird how that happened, like, literally everyone on the train had no clue what was going on or what to do, because it went straight past Lancaster, um, straight to Penrith. So, um... Yeah, we ended up back in Morecambe. We both went home, and that was pretty much it. Like, I told my um, parents, and they were they were laughing about it, which um, is, a, is a bit weird. But yeah, that's how it is, and you know. So um, anyway, guys, that's pretty much the story um, of how I got the train. And in fact, today that I'm recording this video is Halloween, so um, I'm gonna be recording a. Five Nights at Freddy's 4. Um, I've never played it, so I want to play it. And I've seen other YouTubers play it, and it looks quite funny. Um, but I'm thinking about recording, like, two Halloween special videos, like Silent Hills for the PC, which um, some of you guys are thinking, wait, that only come out on PS4. But there's been one that's made for the PC. Like, it's a completely different, like, people that made it. But yeah, I might be playing both of those games for a Halloween special episode, and I hope you guys enjoy it. I will be doing a face cam reaction type of thing, and it's going to be so funny, guys. I'm looking forward to it. So, um, yeah, so subscribe so you know like as soon as I upload that video, it will give you a notification. So you can watch it, and you'll probably laugh your head off, because I'll probably cry. But yeah. Anyway, um, that's pretty much it, guys. If you liked the video, give this um, video a massive like. As that would be, be supportive, but if you like dislike the video, then please hit the dislike button as I'll know what content to upload um, next. And if you liked my video, give it a massive, massive subscribe. And if you like, like you'll see all of my videos that I've uploaded, and you'll get notifications when I upload cool videos. Um, but yeah, sorry this video has been quite boring. I have been quite busy at the moment, and. You know, I thought it would be quite funny for you guys to listen to um, our little train journey that uh, went horribly wrong. Um, so yeah, I'm signing out guys and see you in the next video. Bye for now. Yeah.